Yo guys, this is Delirious Sanity, and today I've got the in-depth all nine locations for the Underground Railroad mod. I told you guys I would do this when I first uploaded the mod, and so here I am. First and foremost, if this video was informative in any way, shape, or form, I would really, really appreciate it if you would help me out by subscribing. It took me a good hour, hour and a half to find all of these locations today. So please, it takes you a second to subscribe. It took me an hour and a half to find these stuff. So that's the least you can do. But anyway guys, let's get on with the video. Uh, the first one is there's Sanctuary. Uh, it's right outside of Sanctuary. These things are like little uh, sewer um, pipes. So you go in there and you have to find all nine locations for this to work the best. You come in here and there's a locked gate you have to unlock and when you do you're golden. Um, yeah. So first of all I'll show you where they all are because I know you're just wanting that part of the video. So the sanctuary manhole is obviously right here outside of sanctuary. That's the first one. Concord manhole is right here in Concord. That's the second one. I'm doing these in no order. Medford one is right here next to the Medford hospital which is right here. It's Medford manhole right here. More to the right we've got the Salem manhole right here right outside of the witchcraft museum going a little bit lower we've got the Weston manhole right here right next to the Weston water treatment plant going a little bit more to the right you've got the Cambridge one right here right next to the Kendall hospital Cambridge manhole. Going more to the right, here you've got one at Boston Airport, right outside of the Boston Airport, obviously. And into the Commonwealth, you've got one here. Oop, no, that's not it. One. You've got the Diamond City manhole, which is right outside of Diamond City. It's easy enough to find. That one's probably one of the easiest besides Sanctuary. Going a little bit lower, you've got the Quincy manhole right here, right outside of the Adam Katz garage. To the left, this one's a bit hard to find and see. So you've got the uh, Milton General Hospital and Fallen's department store surrounding it but the South Boston manhole is right here and I believe that is all of them let me yep that's all of them so yeah guys I let me go through and count them real quick just one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so yeah, that's that's all nine of them. So yeah, those are the locations. That was really hard for me to find, so I would really appreciate it if you subscribed if this video was useful. And here I'm going to kind of just show you how I've got my place set up. None of this stuff was here beforehand. It was just an empty room, but it's pretty cool. Now, um, I have a flag outside of each of them that represents who owns that place or what is most rampant there. Obviously, the Minutemen in Sanctuary. I've got uh, Raiders at Salem, Minutemen in Concord. Uh, Institute because there's a lot of synths near Medford Brotherhood at Boston Airport I just put the American flag near the Diamond City because everybody goes there I've got the Institute at Weston because there was a lot of Institute there I've got the Brotherhood at Quincy because I consider 
the Adam Cats closest to the Brotherhood. They're not blur- they are not Brotherhood, but I would consider them closest to the Brotherhood because they love Power Armor just as much as the Brotherhood. You've got the Institute here at Cambridge because that is full of synths, and you've got Raiders once again here at South Boston because there's a lot of Raiders there. And I've got uh, my chem station here, and then if you go, I've got signs surrounding all of this place. And then I've got all of the other stations, including the ones that come with UCO overhaul. And I've got chairs for everyone to sit down, and I've got every single mixed Nuka-Cola. Not the original Nuka-Colas, because those are just too easy to find. But the mixed one. I use this machine to mix them. This comes in Nuka World, if you're not familiar with that and you can mix your nuka colas in it and you can create all kinds of nuka colas this is all of them every single one of them i've got a trunk each of them will be for weapons clothes ammo aid and whatnot but i haven't really filled them up yet because uh, i have no use for that i've got turrets on every corner so that we've got defense going on i've got these power armor stations and i will eventually fulfill them and inside of the boston airport I've got legendary spawning items, so if you need legendary when you're going to Boston. Also one in Diamond City. This one is not filling up, I don't think, because I accidentally threw it into the wall, but um, that's besides the point. And then I believe I had one at Sanctuary. Where is that? Sanctuary. Yeah, one at Sanctuary, and this one fills up. So yeah, and then of course I have a bed and a cooking station for me when I'm playing survival mode, which is pretty much all the time now. So yeah. That's how I set up mine. Those are all nine locations. Uh, that's about the end of it for this one. I appreciate you guys watching my video. Subscribe and check out my other mod reviews. I have lots of mod reviews. And uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Enjoy your mods and enjoy your day. Peace out, guys.